Peter. Peter. Welcome back to Earth. Hey. Catching up on some reading? Yeah. What are you up to today? No, I'm not really. You mean give yourself a reason to see Audrey? I guess you know me a little too well. Well, I've known you how long? Yeah, we dated. Don't forget about that. Yeah, what in eighth grade? You mean hold hands once or twice? Yeah, so then the asshole says he wants it back when he's done. He did not. Yes, he did. What a pervert! I know, that's what I was thinking. <laughs> How's it going, Clyde? Yeah, you know, same old, same old. Hi, Lily. Hi, Clyde. So what are you doing today? Squat for your bones. Wow, that's great, man. See you later. Yeah. Hi, Audrey. Hi. Yeah, so I just came to run a movie. Well, you came to the right place. Today's the day I'm going to say something. Well, I don't want to be around my best friend makes a fool of himself. I'm going to go outside. Hmm, never saw this one before. Me neither. Yeah, so, um, I was, uh, wondering, um, like, if you weren't doing anything tomorrow, or whenever, maybe, um, you'd want to, I don't know, like, do something with me? Yeah, that would be great. Great. <laughs> That's my car right over there, man. Great. You know, I was thinking about it. It would be a, I think it, yeah, I think it would be a good idea if I would like suck cock for like a month. Get this cool racing stripe down the middle. Then I would stop, you know, sucking cock. Get away from me. Okay. See you, Clyde. Bye, Peter. Good for you, Peter. Good for you. Thanks. Finally, uh, grew some balls and asked her out, huh? <laughs> yeah. What are, you, what are you gonna wear? Probably this. Uh, I have to meet Oh, her. Peter, Peter, Peter. When I was your age, when, when, when we went out on dates, we just a little fancier. Wow. Did you get her flowers? Uh, no, I didn't. Peter, you, you have to get her flowers. I, I didn't think of it. <laughs> Pete, she's gonna think you're a real bum. Oh, this coming from a guy that lives in a shack in the woods. Hey, I choose to live here. Yeah, I still don't get it. It satisfies me. I still don't get it. I mean, you have enough money to buy a small crunchy, you can at least buy a house. I like it here. It's... It's peaceful. I guess. Well, I gotta get going. I don't wanna be late. Okay, you you have a you have yourself a fun time, Peter. Oh, I will. See you later. So, tell me more about yourself. You know, like, what do you do? Um, what do you mean? Well, like, you know, job-wise. Oh, well, I'm sort of between jobs right now. Um, I used to pump gas, but I started hating it for a while, so I quit. Oh, wish I could just quit my job. 
Why don't you? Well, you know, like bills to pay, that sort of thing. Oh, you live by yourself? No, I live with somebody. I live with a roommate. Well, my roommate's name is Valerie. You know, we kind of grew up together. I've known her for years. Oh, really? Well, tell me more about you. Uh... I mean, like, what kind of music do you like? God, uh, things from Tony Bennett to 80s rock. Oh, wow. Me too. Really? Yeah. Shut up! Please forgive me for not drooling all over those tired, exploited, corporate bands that the entire counterculture of America turn to because they're so misunderstood and have such horrible lives. Yeah, well, teach his own, you know. Do you have a favorite movie? No, that's tough. Well, if I can narrow it down to one, no, I can't. What are your favorites? Uh, let's see, The Breakfast Club, Casablanca, uh, Back to the Future, you know, things like that. Wow, really? That's my favorite movie ever. Must be nice, you know, to be able to go back in time, change things. Yeah. So, do you want to see a movie or something? I'm just going to go in the bathroom real quick and freshen up. Okay. Uh, just make yourself at home. Can I uh, ask you a question, Peter? Uh, shoot. Do you, like, do you get scared? Hey, you guys ready? Yep. See you later. Bye, Peter. So I heard this movie was really good. Well, have you ever heard of a rich movie that wasn't good? You got me there. <laughs> <laughs> God, I haven't been on a date in so long. So this is a date? That was the impression I was under. Right. Well, it just seems like I don't even find the right guy anymore. I guess I have a chance. What? I didn't say anything. Oh, it was a typical day, can't complain. Well, of course I could a little. No, it's not even worth mentioning. Well, it's just that Peter's out with this girl and used to be me and him all the time. No questions asked, just Peter and Lily every day. What? He's my best friend, of course I'm gonna be a little protective. Jealousy is definitely not the word I would use to describe it. I just don't want to lose him again. Peter, can I ask you a question? Oh, well, the last time someone said that to me, it was followed very shortly by a very disturbing question. Well, if the question freaks you out, you don't have to answer it. Okay, good deal. Well, I was going to ask what you were thinking when we were at the park and you were kind of gazing into my eyes. Okay, this is embarrassing. Come on, we've known each other, each other for a while and you shouldn't be embarrassed. Well, I am. Well, don't answer then. No, I will, because I know I'll just hit myself later if I don't. I was wondering what it would be like to kiss you. Well, maybe you should find out. His name's Peter. He likes to read. I, oh well, he's really nice. 
when he doesn't really talk too much, but when he does, I get this this great feeling around him. This like really great feeling. Wow, that's that's cool. So it sounds like you really like this guy. I don't know. I'm not even sure if I'm really looking for someone right now. You know, things are so confusing enough as it is. Yeah, I guess you're right. Oh yeah, guess what? My parents are getting me those pigs. I can do my experiments. Oh, Amanda, that's great! I'm so excited. I would be too. You know what, I gotta go. I'm gonna be late for work. Oh, okay. I'll see you later. Yeah, I'll call you tomorrow. Okay. This happy moment. Because we're happy now. <laughs> Hello? Billy, what's the matter? What? I'll be right over. Lily? Lily, what's the matter? Come on, tell me. You're my best friend. You can tell me. I miss you so much, Peter. <laughs> I miss you too, Lily. No, it's not that. Then what is it? Peter, say something. Why did you do that? What possessed you to kiss me? I don't know. I think maybe I might have feelings for you again. Oh, that's just dandy. Vic, maybe you could have waited till I was a little more in love with Audrey to tell me this? But Peter, no, I- No, 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 this is complete bullshit. How am I supposed to deal with this? I just had to tell you. Well, you definitely should not have. Just leave me alone. dream. Oh, What about? I don't want to talk about it. It's crazy. Okay. 
Well, I better get ready for work. Hey, Audrey? Yeah? Are you happy? What? Like, with our relationship? Of course, why? I don't know. I just thought I'd ask. Why do you ask? I don't know. Just these past few months have been the happiest times of my life. I really don't want to lose you. You're not going to lose me. I'll always be here. I love you. I'll always love you. Hello, Valerie. Spend the night again, Peter? You got me. I couldn't help but overhear your conversation in there. You have a right to be scared. Oh, really? The fact of the matter is, you don't deserve her. I don't. No, you don't. One day she's going to wake up and think to herself, what am I doing with this guy? He's a loser. He's never going to amount to anything. And then you'll have nothing. Well, it's been great talking to you, Valerie. Same here. Amanda, hi! Hey, long time, no see. Uh, Amanda, look, I don't even know what to say. What is there to say? You left me behind. I'm old news. No, look, it's not like that at all. It's just that... Th that you have someone else, huh? I'm so sorry. Don't be. Just go. Oh my, I'm so happy for you. Yeah, so I'm going to meet Audrey for breakfast now. Actually, I was just about to, uh, to leave myself. Where are you going? Uh, I gotta catch a bus. <laughs> Where? I'm going up to Albany, visiting some family for a few days. Family? Yeah, that's cool. Have fun. Uh, as much fun as my family can be. Yeah, well, I should probably be going. Uh, all right, man. See you later. See you later, Peter. Oh, um, Peter. Don't trust anyone. Peter, we have to talk. The fact of the matter is, we've grown apart. Here's the thing. I'm a bitch. I'm a horrible person. I treat you like crap. I treat everybody like crap for that, that matter. I'm shallow. I love looking at myself, actually. Peter, say something. So, that's it then? Well, obviously, I still want to be friends. Oh, what do you say? Yeah, of course. Great. Like I was telling you, you know, I feel horrible, yeah. but you know what? I Peter. Hey. I heard. Oh, really? Yeah. I figured this is how you would take it. Why did you figure that? It's become your routine, Peter. Let me guess, in the last two weeks you've left your room only to eat and piss? Please go away. 
You know, Peter, there are some people that care about you. Don't need to hear this. Peter, you don't want to date someone like that. I saw her the other day. She was with Amanda, you know that pig guy? She was all over him. That's fucking impossible! That guy? That's impossible! See? This is so not fair. Oh my god, it's Peter. I think he's looking at us. Hurts, huh? You're enjoying this. What? I hope it feels good to be right all the time. For now on, just stay away from me. You're thinking of me. No, I'm not. You're imagining this? I'm part of your mind. I know you're thinking of me. Okay, I am. Sue me. You think it's your fault that we broke up? Yeah, I guess I do. Well, ding, 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 we have a winner! What? I thought you said... I know what I said. But to tell you the truth, you're extremely childish. What? And you don't go to school, you live with your parents, you have no job, and guess what? You'll probably never amount to anything. I can't believe this. You see, Peter, when girls get to be my age, they want a mature guy, someone who looks like, oh, well, they might have a future ahead of them. Oh, oh right, like a, like a pig scientist, right? Don't even bring him into this. He had nothing to do with what happened to us. Hey, I'm just saying, you moved on pretty quick. Well, he's the one I should be with at this particular time. Oh, then I'm really happy for you. No, you're not. You're right. Yeah, you only care about your own happiness. That's how it always was. You know what? I think you're using this anger towards me to take the focus off the real issue here. Well, what's the real issue here? You're in love with Lily. What? Me love Lily? That's the most insane thing I've ever heard. Well, you're forgetting something. I'm part of your mind. You can't lie to me. I am not in love with Lily. Audrey? Hey, Peter. I was looking for Lily. Is she here? Hi, Peter. Hi, um, can we talk? Well, sure, Peter. What is it? I feel stupid. What? What's going on? Jesus, what do I say? I'm sick and tired of teen romance. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>